Welcome to Atticon Plays Farm Manager 2021. All right, hi, this is Atticon, and welcome to Series 13, Episode 3 of Farm Manager 2021. We're playing the duck, potatoes, and beetroot scenario. So we finished off our duck meat. We've just started on the pig meat. We haven't done the pickles yet. We held, we intentionally held them to last till we had all our other conditions met before we started these. Uh, we're about to finish our beets, and that's weird. It was 96% uh, earlier when we looked at it. now it's 77. What's the deal? And we finished our potatoes. So let's take a look. We've got um, we've got farms producing oat and soy, and organic and inorganic, <laughs> organic and non-organic grass, and we've got we're making our own silage, both organic and non-organic. So we are feeding our cattle. Uh, we've taken off the beetroots. We've got crops coming up right over here. They will be. Uh, that's probably questionable. We're probably, uh, yeah, we may have to turn those off too. But we've got, we're, we're feeding our pigs only the oats and soy, which we're producing. And we're, we've, we're feeding our ducks only the um, oats and soy, which we're producing. And we've got rye crops coming up over here. When they come up, we'll feed, give them something else to eat. But we'll, we'll turn the rye on, certainly for the pigs. We've got now um, a slaughterhouse working for the uh, pigs. And I need one more manufacturing person. We'll get this guy assigned, and then we will uh, buy our pigs. We're going to feed them oat and uh, sorghum, and we're going to make another pen. Three, six, nine, and a house. We need a house, too. So let's put a house in, turn it this way. Give it a road. Just to be certain, we'll put some decorations in here. We don't really need to, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There we go. And we will put in our large pigsty. Ah, shoot. And it can't go in because of those decorations right there. There we go. Now we can put the decorations back. And uh, 36912. We'll need uh, 16. We'll need uh, another large pigsty. And 
And really another one out through here. Three, six, nine. Two, five, six, seven, eight. So this will be this house, and we're going to need another house for this one here. This doesn't make sense. Three, six, seven. Eight. Yeah, it, it, it's tough when they don't match up. The large, the houses are eights. The uh, pig styes are uh, um, uh, three apiece. So you get three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, and we're gonna put another one here and here. Which will give us 20, we need 24 people and three total houses at the end of the day. So, see if we can get another person in here. And then we're going to start hiring into this house. And we'll put. Put those two in here. And we'll tell this guy that he can now start taking from this uh, lot anything above 20. You can see we're just now getting them in and and he'll come over and, and pick them all, pick up some of them. And we still need another, another, uh, uh, large die here, three, six, and one here. Three, eight times three is 24, yeah. And then we'll put a, a house, we can just put a house right out here. And let, let's just put some decorations. Oh. Uh, put some along the road as they come out, and some, some over here around the barn. On the corner, two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, that'll, that'll do it. Hire into this house. Animal people. Okay. And we'll wait one more day and get this finished off. And then we'll go over here and make sure these assignments are set. And then we'll be uh, 
No, I don't want to do this. I want to do this. Higher end of this house. And something's not working out. Oh, we got two of them. Six. We need six. Good, good. All right. New, another, another day has passed. Let's go in here and look for animals, and there are none. We'll wait till the 23rd. What's the problem? Oh, well, well, that'll get taken care of. The diseased field. Okay, let's see if we can get some animal people. A couple. So let's fire off this one here. That's only two. Uh, buy pigs. All right, so 16. They only need two a cycle. They've got eight cycles in advance. I think we could probably support another one of these, another slaughterhouse. And but, but the next thing we want to do actually is put in a vegetable plant. We have 26,000 beets that we have stored up. So we can put in a vegetable plant, start it making beets until we get some uh, cucumbers grown. And then um, we can switch over to the pickles. That's disease, but it's being sprayed, so no problem. All right, so let's do um, warehouse vegetable processing. Uh, I don't. It doesn't look like there's anything we can do with beets. <laughs> Figures. Okay, let's put a put a plant right there. Give it a road like that in a warehouse. And a house.
A little bit of overkill on the flowers, that's okay. Don't want these breeding messages. We know they breed. <laughs> Let's see what we can make here. I see nothing with beets. Our pickles, uh, let's make sure. Yes, pickles are made with cucumbers. So if we set that to go, I don't want to buy cucumbers. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to make, uh, do we have anything out there? We have soy. How much soy do we have? We have 131,000. Okay, we're going to start out making the soya cutlets. Okay, and we're going to sell those. We'll sell those cutlets above zero. And we're waiting on our cucumber crops over here. But what we're going to do in the meantime is put down, um, I think we'll go right down through here. We're going to do something I'm not a big fan of, but we'll see if we can get something out of it. One, two, three. Uh, Here comes our guy to give us some money. Good job. And we'll put in a house and a warehouse. And we're going to raise cucumbers. And we will irrigate this and we'll use manure, which means we're going to want, probably going to want to make it efficient, we'll put manure right there. Okay, we're going to put uh, these two folks over here. 
doing doing this. Oh, and I'm going to set the scope of this house down like this, so that it can't touch those. I think I, I think I got a slip seal on that one. That didn't work right. Let's try this again. Okay. In this house, we want plant people. And I want their scope to be brought down to be like that. So they work only on the uh, hot houses or the greenhouses. Give them some more skill. And we they need they need some uh, flower, they need some decorations for sure. They're they're not the happiest people in the world. They have to do manual labor, they don't like that. Good grief. Oh, we got them all. Okay. There we go. We got some people working in there. And we'll we will monitor. Let's monitor our um cute Oh, we're already, we already are. The cucumbers. As soon as we start producing cucumbers, we'll flip this over to do the uh, uh, pickles. So, eight people doesn't appear to be enough to work this. Not steadily.
Hmm. Trying to decide what to train. Uh, I, th I think we're going to increase the storage capacity because these big harvests are a problem. Now it's December. In fact, it's Christmas. Merry Christmas. Um, now let's see what these things are going to do. Well, right now they're not going to do anything. We've got a total of 10 people working. That seems to be doing okay. I hate the inefficient house, but I'll put up with it for a time being. Yeah, even that's not enough. Plant people. Our pigs seem to be doing just fine. I don't remember, did I? I did give him all those different ones. Yes, I did. He's got 30, he's got plenty. We could probably support another, um, another uh, slaughterhouse with these pigs. In fact, we could figure that out. All we have to do is look and see what's what are we creating? Pigs, two, no, yeah, no. Oh, we don't know. We don't. There's no stats on how fast they breed. We know they're making all kinds of manure, but we don't know anything else about it. Okay, are you going to tell me something now? Not yet. Okay, they're planting. When the planting is done, maybe we'll get a prediction. 500, so this will make 2,000. And this, that'll be 10 runs. Or no, no, that's some soya. Uh, if, we change, if we look at the production for the pickles, it takes 250 to make 200. So this uh, 200 here would do is that right? Yeah, five. This will make two runs, two, four, six, eight. That's eight runs. So it'll make um, 1,600 pickles. We got to 11,500. <laughs> These things are a waste of time. Tell you what we could do, we've hit our duck goal and the duck numbers don't exactly blow anybody away. We could switch, why don't we, I hate doing this, let's change the production to the pigs. And then, uh, And there's, and I hate how they do this. I can't tell which pin this is. There's no, well, you have to actually 
point to it to tell, and then you're not sure. The pin name should be on here so you can tell. But uh, I think what we'll do is, is split these in two. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Uh, first of all, let's make sure this one has the range. All these are green, so he can get them all. So let's just have him pick from the first four on this list. I'm going to assume they're the same list for both of them. So you, you do anything above 20. On those first, first four. And you are not going to do one, two, three, four but you'll do the rest of them. And we'll see if we can get both of these going. And I think we're going to... Uh, Oh man, if they don't, <clears throat> this is not an easy process, is it? Is there any way to identify these people? Ah, I'll just have to go through it. Um, we're just going to get out of the duck business altogether.
70 days. Good grief. Now, uh, 70 days. How long is the winter? 70 days. So, we're going to skip the winter. And we should have a harvest here. Shouldn't we? Uh... Where's our cucumbers? Oh my word. We skipped winter and it threw out all our cucumbers. Okay. Don't want to hear your error message. Uh, you got 24, you got 14. You both have plenty. Now, what I do want to do here is go think about, now it's early, but I want to get all the harvest stuff that we need here. So, okay, to harvest these, we're going to need this five, uh, five meter chopper. And a self-propelled forage harvester which I believe is a rather large beast uh, let's move ahead a bit uh, we've uh, set up this kind of tractor arrangement for the harvest before and that's what we're going to do here is just focus on getting all the tractors we need in order to support the harvest of these crops when they come in in the fall We're getting, oh, we're, we're accumulating too much manure. So let's pause for a second. Go back to our trades, look at manure. Well, we're, we're selling it, let's sell it above 20,000. And then is there another, uh, yeah, the liquid manure, we're probably gathering that up too. Let's sell that if above zero. We had 79,000 of that accumulated. That's what's messing us up. So these are all manure errors. And once this guy buys our manure, we won't have that, those problems anymore. Okay, our smokehouse is gonna want electricity. And we're going to need some manufacturing people here. One, two, three. That's good. Now, if they do... A hundred... They need a hundred a cycle. These things put out 190 each a cycle, which is 280. So we could do two smokehouses easily. So we're going to smoke that and make smoked... Uh, pork and then we're going to set up a trade to sell the smoked pork above zero 
if we look at the prices that's 3665 the pigs 14 so yeah that's a good good deal Okay. Uh, put a warehouse right next to them. Oh, oh, we've got it on bio. I don't want bio pigs. I want, uh, regular pigs there we go Thirty days for those, and over here we've got twenty-two days. So <laughs> these greenhouses, oh man, I, I love them. They're just so nice, so awesome. How much time we got left? Three hundred days. Oh, we're good. We're in good shape. Good shape. Here we go, we're getting our first cucumbers. Oh, the greenhouses actually are gonna contribute. All right, we've got some cucumbers, so we're gonna switch over immediately to our pickles. Finally, we're making some. I don't understand how they could have enough and then they don't have enough. Find that a little strange. Okay, this one's ten days, this one's nineteen, so when that 10 starts coming in, we'll actually get something done here. But look at this. <laughs> oh, these things are awful. How many greenhouses do you need to get anything done? And look at how many people you have to have to keep them running. Now, I've, made, I've probably got it overkill now out of frustration, but still, it's just ridiculous.
Ooh, ooh, ooh. What's the deal here? Not enough staff. Oh, crap. What, what do they harvest with? It must be one of those things. No, I don't even... Do they have to be picked by hand? <sighs> well, I hired two more people and suddenly there's enough. Oh my word, they have to be picked by hand. Okay, learning something new. thing of it is, I'm going to bump up this price and hope, hope we can get plenty of people to get out here and help help pick uh, cucumbers. And what I was about to say, this thing will not empty any of the loads. It will have zero until they finish. If I'm not mistaken, they have to finish the entire field. these people helping that's kind of the point of them is to is to help maybe you can only have so many doing it I don't I don't know anybody know put in the comments if you do know I am at a loss as to why they aren't out here helping. Seems like all we've got is our permanent employees out here doing all this work. It's interesting, they don't seem to mind doing manual labor out here. I guess it's outside, there's a beautiful field, whatever. But our seasonal workers aren't picking anything. We've got 12 of them and they were paying them to sit in the house. Well, they must part pick toward the center. I think we're closer to done than I thought. Maybe.
maybe not. No, he's only got 10,000. I think there's 20 some thousand supposed to come out of his field. And we got another one over here. Oh, I think I, I see the problem here. There. Oh, dummy here. If I had just turned that on, these uh, the, you have to have the, man, it's interesting. You have to market manual allowed for the seasonal workers to get out and help. But if, if you don't market, the full-time people will get out here and work. So uh, I find that a little strange. So, I have to give our uh, hated greenhouses some credit. They're helping us. We've got 244 days left, and we're getting there. So, we're, we're, we're going to make it. We're going to make it. Storage malfunction. Got to do a repair. Starving animals. Uh, why would that be? Are we out of oats? We got plenty of oats. Yep. No, there, it just went up. I didn't think it was going up. 4,000 in here. I'm not sure how that's happening, but unless these people are dropping them off. Oh, they are. The people over here are actually taking them into, into this warehouse, which is actually useful because it's allowing our factories to keep running. So there, we're almost done. All right, so this is probably the worst farm I've built since I started playing the game, or since I've, you know, had a little bit of experience on it. Uh, but it was okay, and I liked having an extra little challenge. It did make it a little more fun, and um, I, th I think we met the challenge. We kind of started this early, but had we left it till later, we, we easily produced 4,200 again, easily. And we had no, well, look at this, we did 10,000, and then we, of course, got out of the duck business uh, later on. And toward the end of this, we were feeding them the proper stuff that we were producing. So we, we had no problem doing any of these. And uh, it was fun to have, have a little challenge, to have that time constraint, and to have a little extra, a little one extra rule. You have to, had to grow what you fed the animals and grow what you produced uh, uh, really made it a, a lot better. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope it'll help you become a better player. I hope you'll like, comment, and subscribe, and join us for our next Farm Manager 2021 video. Thank you.